Hey guys, your girl is in the Hams in Miami. Um, I just got in. I let me tell y'all. First of all, I'm about to like reshape my hair because it's not as it's straight, but it's like not as straight as I want it to be, and I didn't have a chance to like go over it today. But you guys, all I'm gonna say is I was supposed to be here last night. They delayed my flight three times, then had the audacity to delay it for a fourth time and say over the intercom, hey, just to let you know, the flight is delayed until 11.15 the next morning, which is today. So, I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna change the flight all in general because I had already been traveling and I wanted to get some rest because I was at the airport yesterday at 8 a.m. getting back and I'm like, you know what? We're just gonna switch some things around. So I'm in Miami because I am shooting with my outfit online again. And the shoot was supposed to be today, but I, there was there was literally no flight that was gonna get me to Miami in time. Cause the shoot's at 8.30 and was at 8.30 this morning and there was no flight that was gonna get me here on time with no other airlines. So um, we rescheduled it for tomorrow, which worked out cause I was able to rest y'all. I was extremely tired, <coughs> excuse me. I was extremely tired. So, my hair has been so frizzy lately. I mean, not frizzy, ecstatic -y lately. Like, I have no idea why. I just gave myself a wash yesterday. I did it myself, by the way. Um, and, like, it looks good, but it's just so static -y. But anyways, yeah, I'm out here with my outfit online again. And, I'm so excited to have a reason to be here in Miami. I'm actually about to go get something to eat because I haven't eaten all day. Literally have not ate all day. All I had was coffee, of course. You know, that's part of my meals. <laughs> I had that at the airport, which was disgusting. Didn't It wasn't Starbucks because Starbucks wasn't on the terminal I was on. Um, so I had this one place, which was disgusting. It was way too sweet. And then I had pretzels on the plane because I was like, I need to put something in my belly. So now I'm about to get some real food. It's currently 8 o'clock. My flight got here at like 6.40. It was supposed to get here at like 6. They was doing circles in the damn air. Who knows why? Like, literally don't even know why. But this one extension is like hanging on by dear life over here. And I'm like, how did it even get like that? Like, how? So weird anyways so yeah y'all i've just been and then my uber literally is taking forever then i'm waiting already 10 minutes for him to come back around then she starts the ride while i'm not even in the car she's not even near me it's that i'm like bro what is going on like why is everything just being so difficult like what did i do like why is nothing going right um so i had to cancel that and i'm trying to reach out to uber because they charged me 25 dollars to cancel it and i'm like no 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 wasn't my fault she started the ride and was nowhere near like and she didn't even speak english and i was calling them there wasn't even letting me go through the car oh god um so yeah y'all that's how my day has been going then on the way to the airport, I'm not even gonna talk about that. The airport was so crowded, like always. Atlanta, I'm just over traveling, especially when it comes to the Atlanta airport, bro. It makes me mad every single time thinking about it. Um. Oh boy. Anyways, I just need to get some food and chill, relax my brain because. Then, the flight, oh my gosh, I'm not even, I'm just not going to go play no more. So anyway, yeah, I'm here in Miami for a few days for work, and I'm just excited to be here. Definitely catching some sun while I'm here, because your girl needs a tan, and I'm excited about that. I'm really excited about that. So... Hey, welcome back 
to another vlog. <laughs> Is it gas? It's weird. Lulu, come here, baby. Come on. Come here. I gotta get my um supplements. I have to run out, y'all. I have a birthday dinner, or I mean a birthday party to go to tonight. And I need to do my hair because I'm not gonna have time to get an appointment in because I just got back from Miami yesterday. Um, so I'm gonna have to like wash the top of it. And then, whew, I'm out of breath, y'all. Um, I need to go to the mall because honestly, y'all, I don't know what I'm wearing. And I might want to pick up something just in case. Like, I have ideas, but I'm going to go see what they have in the mall. Um, and I need to go to Target and get some more toothpaste because I'm almost low. I placed an order at Clean Juice. About to go pick me up some avocado toast and a smoothie. But, yeah, y'all, I am back from Miami. And, yeah, we're back to pretty much regular schedule after today. Um, like I said, I'm going to a birthday party tonight. And, um, oof, y'all, just cramped. I'm like, I just made me need to eat. Um, so yeah, I got back yesterday, didn't vlog nothing. Um, my cleaners had dropped Lulu off. So he was home yesterday with me. Ah, Lulu! Ow! So he was home with me yesterday. Am I ashy or? I can't tell if I'm ashy or just like, I don't know. Yeah, so he was dropped off yesterday and 
Um, yeah, we just chilled in the house, got some things done. I'm doing laundry right now also. And I plan on wanting to film a makeup tutorial for tonight because I got so many questions on, oh my God, are you gonna do a makeup tutorial? We love the makeup from the picture I posted. The selfie I posted, the last selfie I posted on my page. And y'all, I ain't gonna lie, I've been doing my thing with my makeup lately and I'm just like, I might as well spill the tea because it's giving full beat. <sighs> I'm out of breath. It's giving full beat and you know, ooh, this water bottle is cold. And you guys know I like the natural, but ain't, ain't, never can go wrong with a nice full beat. Can never go wrong with a nice full beat. So, um, I have a package. I have a package. Oh, my new smoothie thing came, y'all. Oh, I'm so excited. Yes. Brainstorming, to be honest. Let me um, get myself situated, get really situated, and I will see y'all once I get my smoothie in. I ordered too because you girl's hungry. I'm hungry. All I'm gonna say is, y'all, I got back home, had to take a nap. I don't know what happened, y'all, but like I took some day quills so I felt better. But I was feeling so nauseous, got the chills, my body was aching. Like I feel 80% better. I'm about to go get me some food because I don't even have the energy to cook. So I did Uber Eats. I'm about to go pick it up. And I'm like, am I gonna make this party? I don't know what the fuck just happened. Maybe Miami is getting to me. <laughs> but the video is not planning on, the video's out. I'm sorry, I can't even do it. Like it's already 6.51. Party starts at 10. Said I was gonna redo my hair, but I think I'm gonna have to set, do a, um, another style. I think I'm about to go get some wave spray from Sephora and spray it and do like a wet look. <sighs> I don't even know what I'm wearing. Couldn't find anything at the mall. Boo. And I have shit in my closet, but I'm just like, oh, what's going on? What's happening? What is happening? <laughs> I'm gonna get a burger from Five Guys, y'all. I need something in my belly. So as y'all see, I did not do my hair. Literally just put a side part, brushed it, and that is that. And we're gonna go with the side part. You know, cute. So let me show you the fit. I still have to put on my shoes, but this is actually a bathing suit body. So this is from Myra Swim. And these pants are from Masoni. Super cute. Love how the back is out. The pants are like a shimmery metallic brown. So I was like, ooh, this would be perfect together. Cause I couldn't find a shirt to go with these pants and I've been dying to wear these pants y'all. So, I'm going to wear it. Sorry, it's a mess, y'all, over here. But I'm going to wear it with this bag. I feel like it just pops. And this is my favorite bag at the moment. So if y'all see me in this every day, every time I go out, mind your business. It's cute. And then I'm wearing these Tom Fords because it just goes very, very perfect with the bronzy gold. So yeah, let me put on my shoes and I'll show you the lip gloss and, um, yeah, hold on now. For perfume tonight, let me pause Burner Boy. By the way, y'all, me and Kayla just bought our Burner Boy tickets. He just posted today that he's coming to Atlanta, July 31st, and we love us some Burner Boy. Like, we love us some Burner Boy. We were like about to plan a trip to go out the country to go see him, but y'all, he just posted a summer tour in Atlanta. I literally screamed. I called Kayla immediately. We bought the tickets within like 10 minutes. We were just finding the seats. Y'all. So, so exciting. We got Aaliyah some tickets for her birthday. It's gonna be like after her birthday, but she loves Burner Boy too, so yeah, girl. So for tonight's boyfriend, tonight's boyfriend, what the fuck? Tonight's perfume is Woman in Gold by Killian. And then I paired it with a little bit of MFK uh, La Rose. So it's very like warm with a little teeny bit of freshness. My type of thing. And then for lip gloss, my finger should be pulling up. For lip gloss, I'm taking an OG of mine, 
this Bare Minerals Gen Nude Lip Gloss in the shade Yas. So let me put it on and then I'll give you a final look. The count of three, I need all y'all to scream to the top of your lungs. Happy birthday, I need you to scream that shit. Y'all got it? Y'all got it? One, two, three. Y'all, I've been sick all day. That's why I've been missing since last night. Like, I was fine when I got home last night. I wasn't, like, crazy drunk, nothing. I was actually chilling, feeling good. Throughout the middle of the night, y'all, it was shivers. Night sweats like crazy. Literally sweated out my hair, y'all. Like, my hair is sweated out. Disgusting. Um, so I've been really sleeping all day hydrating um, i had a crazy headache this morning y'all but i've been wanting spaghetti so i just made me some spaghetti that's a big pound of spaghetti but i'm hungry all i had today was an egg sandwich that i made this morning when i had got up but sorry for being mia we're gonna try again tomorrow i'm feeling definitely a lot better but i don't feel exactly like myself so hopefully tomorrow i feel better i feel better and hopefully tonight is not crazy again because I was going through it last night sleeping. I was sick in the beginning of the year. It was really bad. Like I was out for four days. Like, it was bad. I had a temperature. I took my temperature today. It was 99.5. So it's close to a temp, but not really a temperature. But it was giving mild of what I had at the beginning of the year, which I took a COVID test that time and it said it wasn't COVID. Don't know what it was, but yeah y'all i'm feeling better i don't know what that was but kayla told me people have been getting COVID again and i'm just like i don't got time i do not have time don't mind the mess back there that's stuff i gotta take upstairs i just haven't been back upstairs i haven't been upstairs like all day y'all been on the couch sleeping literally asleep but i'm about to eat this spaghetti watch bel-air and take a shower and call it a night right baby he wants some more spaghetti. You not getting it. But he's so handsome. So handsome. I'm alive. It's a new day. So as y'all just saw, oh, excuse me, me and Louie. Well, I didn't really show you the walk because I was on the phone. But me and Louie just got back from our little walk in Starbucks today, as y'all saw from the inserted footage, little clip. Um, but I'm back home. I'm about to eat some leftover spaghetti. Then I have to run to Target. I need to get like toothpaste, um, toilet paper, things like that. So yeah. Um, I feel better. Um, I don't know. My chest feels weird. Like, <clears throat> it's like, I don't know what it is. I really don't know what it is, but it just feels weird. Like, I don't know. But other than that, I'm fine. Last night, I still had, like, night sweats. Like, really bad. Um, so I don't know what that's about. But I took some NyQuil last night and I was knocked out because the NyQuil put me out. Like I got in the bed 15 minutes later, I was out. So yeah, um, I don't know what, what this was, but it's gotta go. Like I'm pretty much normal. It's just something in my chest feels tight a little bit. Don't know what that's about, but like I said, it's got to go. So, yeah. This week's vlog, well, these last two weeks, <coughs> have just been off schedule. Very off schedule. Um, I did traveling. And just 
wasn't the best week, if I'm being honest. Like, not within me, but like, just with, you know, blogging, <laughs> I will say. But, um, like with me being home, I haven't really been doing much because I have been sick. Um, so yeah, no excuses, but that's what's been happening. Um, Louie, go eat, boy. <laughs> the dog is always in my face. Um, whew. I need to return these Prada shades that I got because I don't like them. I'm gonna show you them. They weren't what I weren't what I was expecting at all. Like this, they're like hella tight on my face and like mm, they're just not giving what I want it to give, you know? And they feel hella cheap for them to be like, I think like almost $400 I think they were. I'm gonna need that money back. <laughs> ASAP. So, yeah, um, after I get done eating, I'm heading over to Target. It has been very hot these last few days. Like, it's been in the 90s. I think tomorrow is gonna be the last day of it being in the 90s. Yesterday was sunny in the 90s while I was in the house all day. <coughs> Y'all, it's just been... Then it's supposed to, after I think tomorrow, it's supposed to be raining, thunderstorming, and everything for like a week straight. So I'm like, what is that all about? But me and Kayla are getting ready for our Jamaica trip. We're going, um, we're leaving on the 28th. Our flight is like, our flight is at like 6 a.m. And then we come back June 1st. We're going to Montego Bay, Jamaica. I'm so excited. I've never been. We're going to have a ball because me and Kayla always have a ball. No matter where we're at. But on trips, it's just so much fun. We were talking about that the other night when we were at my friend Jess's birthday party. As y'all saw previously before this part um we were in the club we were just listening to the songs we're like oh my god bitch i can't wait until we in jamaica turn it up cut it up like we just can't wait um we're literally so excited like countdown really begins because we leave literally in almost a week so we're just so 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 excited and just can't wait. I'm about to uh, be doing sit-ups up into the trip. Do a little, you know, walking with Louie. Because, like, I like the way I'm at. I just want to kind of tone up a little bit. Um, start off slow. Because your girl has not been back in the gym yet. Which I eventually will. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> My SD card was full. That's why I cut off. But anyways, I'm in the parking lot of Target. And I'm about to go get what I told you I was going to get. And then head back in the house. Um, I've literally just been in the car, like, having a thinking moment. But y'all, look at this guy. And how beautiful is that? Ugh, the sunset is beautiful. So yeah, I'm about to go on Target. Um, I'm not gonna vlog in there because I'm just picking up toothpaste and toilet paper. That's it. That's literally it. Um, and then I'm going back in the house and finishing tidying around the house, things like that. And my lips look hella dry. And yeah, that is it. <clears throat> like I said, this vlog has not been this at all. Like at all. Everyone's like stopping <clears throat> to take pictures of the sky. So cute. Alright, y'all. I'll catch y'all later. Toodles. So, ladies and gents, <laughs> I am making some orange chicken that I have got from Trader Joe's. My rice just went off actually, that it's ready. I'm just kind of letting the chicken get a little more brown and crisp because I don't really like my chicken to be like soft. Mm. But this is the chicken 
orange mandarin chicken that I got from Trader Joe's. I did not feel like cooking tonight. I had spaghetti for lunch. Was not about to eat spaghetti again for dinner. Had leftover noodles, but don't want noodles. Been having spaghetti last night was noodles. Spaghetti for lunch was noodles. Don't want noodles. Okay. Um. So yeah, just waiting for that to brown. I still need to do my sit-ups, girl. I just had me some tea because, like I said, y'all, my chest feels very funny. I just feel tight. So, yeah, just had my tea. Just waiting for this to finish now. <sighs> y'all, I'm tired, but I have laundry that needs to be folded. Love that. And, um, yeah, that's what's going on for the rest of my night. So I don't have to clean up the kitchen for real. This is pretty much all the dishes I have to do and what I'm eating out of. My rice is in my rice cooker pot, so don't have to clean that. And, um, yeah, <laughs> that's pretty much it for tonight's vlog. Um, I wanted to make a smoothie, like I was gonna just have a smoothie for dinner because y'all, I'm really trying to be looking decent for my Jamaica trip and I have not been eating the best lately and yeah. So I know I'm gonna want something sweet after, so I might just make a smoothie for dinner, I mean for my dessert. But I got, like I told you guys, I got my new smoothie um, machine or blender I should say so if I open it tonight I will definitely put it on the vlog for you guys it's from Beast it's that um, I'm sure you guys have seen this blender I've seen it all over Instagram on the ads so I'm really excited to use it because it's super super cute but let me go ahead and show y'all what the chicken's looking like. I added some sesame oil and some sesame seeds, just a little bit on here. So I wanted it crisp. I already added the sauce that came with it in the packet. There was two packets that came in. But see, it's like a little jiggly still, so I wanna get it a little more crispy. So yeah, y'all, I'm about to dish up my plate, eat, and do the laundry and call it a night. All right. Louis. Hey, what <laughs> <laughs> This really is making me laugh too hard. Oh my gosh, okay. Let's try it again. What do we? Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay, let me see if I can do it right this time. All right, ready? I can't do it straight. I'm gonna do all 20. You gotta give me some psycho. It's my first time really working out with a big one. Okay, 10 more. <laughs> 10 more. Right. Ready? excuse me so guys i am currently in the starbucks drive through on my way to kayla's house was supposed to have been there but had a whole mess with louie 
and then Kayla texted me it was like her pool is open and I need to go home and get my bathing suit and get myself together for the pool and um yeah so it is 90 some degrees outside it is hot we're about to go over there hang out at the pool do some hookah eat some wings I'm starving I haven't ate all day <sighs> this boy and yeah I will catch you guys there um my day started really late because Yo, I didn't go to sleep until like 4 last night. I just couldn't go to sleep. I don't know what happened, but my day started super late. And another reason I'm running late is because I wanted to get some cleaning done. Kayla hates this about me because I always am cleaning and that's why I'm late. <laughs> Something's wrong with me. Something's wrong with me. I just can't. Like, my house is never a mess, but I just like it to be organized and tidy. You know what I mean? And I'm doing laundry. Also, I told y'all I've been doing laundry, so I'm in the process of doing laundry right now. So, that's that. It's super hot outside, super beautiful though. I will catch you guys at the pool. Oh, also it's traffic time and it's gonna take me 35 minutes to get to Kayla's house. Like, without traffic, it's 18 minutes, y'all. 18 minutes to 35 is a tremendous difference. Yeah. What's the airport? That's good. That's good. It definitely need a sweet chili. Sweet chili. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not fully. <laughs> you are wrong. <laughs> All right. Let me try. Public spa shrimp. Mm. Get out. You know I don't play that. Public is actually really good. Let me smell home. You know bad. Definitely need a sauce. That like a sweet sauce. Like yeah. this reminds me of you know what Bahama Breeze is? Mm -hmm. Like that that shrimp for a long time. Yeah. Only they only they have them here. Bahama Breeze? I don't know. Been there since, <laughs> this is all dropping in my food. Alright. You gotta put them onto these Mark pre-made. Um oh, yeah. Cheers. these drinks go crazy. <coughs> Cheers to Cheers. Great Friday. Literally. Cheers to us taking it easy because next weekend, baby. Oh, yeah, we're just told we outside. We have it. Y'all, I've been getting thick. <laughs> <laughs> this has 14%, no, 15% alcohol. That's crazy for a mixed drink. Like It's a margarita already. We got it from the liquor store. What flavor is this one? Um, Perfectly pure? Perfectly pure. <laughs> it's called Flyberry. It pure. is dope. Okay. You said pure. Pure. Pear. Pure. 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 Pear? It's pear. Pear sounds like P-A-I-R. You, how do you say pear? Pear. The fruit? P-E-A-R. Pear. Yeah. Pear. 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 <laughs> That's what I said. I can't. Pear. Pear. You sound like you, you said a pear. pair of shoes. You That's said pear. You said pear. Pear. P-E-A-R. Pear. Okay. Get Siri. <laughs> I'm about to. <laughs> How we do Hey Siri. Yo, so me and Bree, like, How do you we have to. Okay. Wait, I gotta see it. How do you pronounce the fruit pear? Hey Siri. How do you pronounce the fruit pear? Okay. I found this on the web for how do you pronounce the fruit pear. Check it out. We heard her. <laughs> Go to Dix right there. Where? Audio US. Pear. Told you. Pear. You said pear. Pear. You're I saying P E E R. Pear. No, the R is harder. <laughs> she don't know how to say no words, y'all. No, first of all, the word that I don't know how to say, but the say word that I know how to say, say, say right, say, you don't say, say, say right. Say the S word, the food. <laughs> Which one? Oh, I was gonna say other. <laughs> no, say, say, what did you say? Like, sandwich. She said sandwich. sandwich. I sandwich. ain't never heard of sandwich with a G in it. Sand, like S A M. You said sandwich. sandwich. You said sandwich. Sandwich. <laughs> Y'all, the first time she sandwich. said that, it threw me off. I said, what I know this bitch would just say sandwich. <laughs> sandwich. No, me and Brie really have different accents, and like we'll be arguing. Like... No, she's she from New York. She from Atlanta. She from <laughs> goddamn uh, Alabama. I don't know where this girl from with all her accents. <laughs> I grew up in a lot of places. Get, cook, girl. 
girl. <laughs> All right. All right, let's go. Cause I'm trying to tan. Look at what he got. Look, he got every toy. Yeah, Louis, you took every toy out the toy box in my house. I just want to know why you thought we was gonna play catch. <laughs> And Chloe, a big video. But it would taste no like, pause on the counter. I think this tastes like. Oh yeah. <laughs> Not Not I'm about my drinks. Why was I watching that video of us mad excited to eat McDonald's in Amsterdam? Like, and then we were, we're, we're disappointed. It was bad. We're gonna try this in Amsterdam. We don't even eat McDonald's here for real at all. Mm -mm. Oh, I'm gonna go show them this. Mm -mm. No. The hookah? I told you to get the strawberry lemonade. It tastes too thick and sweet. I'm not feeling that. Right? Okay, look, y'all. All right, look. We gotta hurry, girl. See, that's all down at eight. It comes out for you. You feel it? Yeah. It's smooth. Like, yeah. It just comes out. See, look, it makes smoke on its own. You don't have to pull it, and then wow. you just exhale. Yeah, but it's so smooth when you do it. Y'all hear this dog taking out all the toys? Like, what is wrong with him? <laughs> oh my god, I wish they could see this. No, we gotta get him like running the off the stairs and like yeah, it's funny slow mo. <laughs> do the slow mo. <laughs> Chloe, you are grown and fast. Okay, ready? Yo, this shit is so cool. So yeah, it's really for weed. That's really cool. But is you can put hookah on both. Like it's for both. Should I sell these y'all? This is why I got this. I, think so. I really think I should. But they're expensive. been taken out I'm so excited but at the same time I'm like no um I'm taking them out I think I told you guys already I don't even remember you know y'all know I just be up here talking but I'm taking them out because I'm getting braids next week and I want my hair to you know kind of breathe before I get braids because I've had these stitches in for months um so yeah I'd probably give myself a little trip well not give myself but get a little trim and then have her flat iron it, and that's about it. And then after a few days, I'll probably just do my bun, protective style. But um, yeah, I'm on my way there now, and then I'm coming back home. Well, I have a few errands I have to run. I have to go to Target. I still have to return, damn, it's corn. I still have to return those salt and pepper shakers. I kept forgetting about them because they've been in my back seat. So I might go to Bus Head and return those. I want to see if Intermix is open because as I looked on my map and it says temporary, it says permanently closed. So I don't know. We'll see about that. And then <coughs> come back home and finish up the laundry, cleaning around the house. I feel like my house is in shambles right now. Not feeling it. Not feeling it. And you need a clean house to be in a good headspace, right? Anyways, I'm driving. I'm not gonna film the process of taking my extensions out. 
but y'all will see me when it's just my natural hair. I'm nervous to see what it's gonna look like. Y'all, I'm looking through my footage and I never like vlogged after I got my hair done. Well, this is your girl with that big cinch. Um, I just haven't been picking up my camera for real lately for when I was sick for a couple of days. Um, the day I got my hair done was like one of the last days before I was like 100% better. Um, I think I might have some footage on my phone. Probably not though. Because, yeah, I'm not sure. But after I got my hair done, I ended up meeting up with Kayla by her house. We went to this little hookah place and um, bar place, had some food. I didn't smoke hookah because my throat was hurting. But I feel so much better now. Um, yesterday, I was in the house all day only went out to Target to get ingredients for my, or Publix for ingredients for my dinner, which I'm about to eat, which is leftovers. I made me, looks crazy right now, but I made me some soup. If you guys know the Zupatano, I don't even know what it's called, y'all. A soup that I used to love getting from Olive Garden when I used to go to Olive Garden, when I used to live back home in Virginia. I haven't been to Olive Garden in a long time. But I always got this soup, always loved it. This is my second time making it, and I think I did better this time than the first time. My camera's about to shut off because I need to delete some footage. I need to find my other SD card, actually. I think it's upstairs. But, yeah, so I'm about to eat, and then I'm going to go to Jenny's, y'all, and get me some ice cream because I want some ice cream, even though I shouldn't be eating it because I leave for Jamaica on Saturday. There's a lot going on for this vlog. Um, my outfit online is throwing me a dinner on Wednesday, so I'm getting my nails done finally on Wednesday. I'm not sure if I told y'all, but y'all. Went to this new coffee place and I looked at the footage and I must have not been recording. Anyways, it was super cute. I had this really good breakfast burrito, which was super good. I had me a, a hot, a, a hot lavender latte i think it had coffee in it and i had a matcha latte the matcha latte was okay she brought it out warm at first i could have swore i told her iced but she brought it out warm so then she just went and put it in ice and it kind of wasn't the same um but i'm gonna give it another try and it's over there on trabit road i believe that's how you pronounce it um in atlanta and it was really cute love finding little places like that so sorry i didn't show you all that footage but I haven't really been vlogging much, only since Miami, since the last vlog, just because, um, where have I been? After I uploaded that vlog, I pretty much went to Miami the next few days. So that was pretty much it. I was in Miami for work, came back home, was sick, and now we're here. And um, I know you guys are probably like, where's the vlog? It's been two weeks. I know y'all got sick. I'm waiting for um, the dinner on Wednesday because this video is sponsored, but this vlog is actually sponsored by my outfit online. So I have to wait, I had to wait until the dinner. So this vlog will be uploaded or is uploaded now, which will be, <laughs> this vlog is now uploaded. This vlog will be uploaded on Thursday, the 27th. The dinner is on the 26th. And then I leave for Jamaica, um, which is gonna be a totally different vlog. I'm gonna start like prepping for Jamaica and everything. Start vlogging that on Thursday. And then, like I said, it'll be its own vlog. But um, yeah, I didn't get a lot done this week because I was sick. And um, my energy levels have just been really low from being sick. And I'm just like, I don't know what it was, but it was bad, y'all. It was really, really bad. Um, as I told y'all a couple minutes ago, early in the vlog. But yeah, I'm about to eat so I can go to Jenny's. And um, I'm also actually currently working on this vlog on the footage I already have because the vlog has to go up at a certain time on um, Thursday after the dinner. And I wanna have that done because I know that you know, I might be drinking and whatnot. 
at the dinner and I know I'm not gonna wanna have that in my back of my in the back of my head. Like I have to be up early to finish this vlog. I wanna just have it out of the way and just have to throw in there and edit in there the footage from the dinner. So that's that update. Sorry I haven't been the best vlogger these past two weeks. <laughs> um I'm still here though. Haven't vanished for months like I normally do, okay? <laughs> But yeah, I will catch y'all at Jenny's. Let me just go ahead and show y'all the soup in case y'all recognize it. But we have some potatoes, some spicy hot Italian sausage, ground Italian sausage, kale, and then seasoning, of course. So good, you guys. Oh, I love this. I have so much in here, so much leftovers for just me. So tomorrow will be the last day I'm eating it. But y'all, so good. It's just super hot right now. And then this is what I'm having for my little drink. These are really good. And these are actually really good for a base if you're trying to make a nice cocktail also. So I actually changed my mind. <laughs> my gosh, I high tea. <laughs> I am going to make these sugar cookies or snickerdoodle cookies. Can't even talk. Snickerdoodle cookies. These have been in there for a little bit and I've just been lazy to make them. I'm like, why did I buy these instead of buying pre made cookies you just put in the oven? Because I'm not a baker. But we bought two. Bake these cookies and make them because we are not letting them go to waste. No, no, we are not. <laughs> so, let's get the cookie baking started. These are the cookies. <laughs> um, some are a little hard. And I will say that these are not giving insomnia. And I am very upset. Very upset. <laughs> Junior, 
I can't really see where did I miss. Mm. Mm. Junior Watson, I be on my knee. Junior Watson, I be on my knee. Tell him this. Did he miss? Y'all, I had to go back and eat another tuna sandwich. So I had two, it just didn't show it all that part. <laughs> but this is the uh, final outcome. Okay. My groceries are here. Definitely um, delivered them. I had them delivered because I don't plan on leaving the house today. I have too much to do. And they just got here. I really don't know what I'm about to make for dinner, but I got some stuff to make and um the asian these asian cucumber salad that i can see on instagram so i got the ingredients for that and i got ingredients for this arugula strawberry feta cheese onion type of salad um because y'all know i'm leaving for jamaica on saturday and i'm really not trying to eat anything too crazy um i have literally all of today i had two tuna fish sandwiches but we're we gonna act like I have one, and that's better than eating fried food, pasta, rices, things like that. So, um, I mean, the, bre the bread was white bread, which was the best. Uh, probably should have ate the two without the bread. Probably should have ate the second one without the bread. Um, so, I just got stuff to make that um, for dinner. I'm probably really just gonna have the salad because your girl is trying to be bright and tight in these bikinis, okay? Um, but yeah, so anyways, let me go and get those groceries real quick. These are not the cucumbers I wanted. They must have been out. These are super mini. This is not what I wanted. <laughs> but <clears throat> I'm gonna have to make work. Wow. You know, Kroger's, <laughs> you can't really rely on them too well. They don't be having shit a lot of the time. I got my apple cider vinegar and lemon because we are doing that once a day. Really should be a morning thing, but I'm actually about to have some right now. Some lemon water with my apple cider vinegar. See, this is my fault for not paying attention to... I wanted onion powder, not... Why would they give me two garlic? I put onion. They gave me three, hold on, where's my phone? Three garlic powder? Let me make sure what I did not mess up. Why would you give me three? You gave me garlic and I wanted, why would you give me, oh my gosh. Would I be wrong to take garlic powder back to the store? Like, do they even give you a receipt? What am I doing with four, three garlics? Like what? That's so irritating. Very irritating. Three garlic powders, y'all. Three. That's really irritating. Okay. But I guess you can never have too much garlic powder, right? It is a little bit of a 
It's a waste of money. So my camera's been charging. I am um, currently re home. Did I? I was about to say. I know I got me some extra scents. Which one I wanna use? Cozy linen or cactus blossom? Cozy linen has definitely been a new favorite of mine. They even made strawberry pound cake, which was one of my favorite Yankee candle. I mean, not Yankee candle, wow. Bath and Body Works candle, and I've never seen it in a plug-in. Mm, strawberry pound cake. Don't use that in the bathroom. I like clean scents just all over. Um, I think I have strawberry pound cake in my bedroom. Um, and it's super strong, and it's in my bedroom. I think I'm gonna use, I think I'm gonna just use strawberry pound cake, just cause, yeah. I kinda wanna get rid of it, cause it's good, but like, wasn't a big fan of it. I guess in a plug-in. I mean, it's cool, but maybe just not, I don't know. Maybe I'm just tired of smelling it in my bedroom. And since I go in there so often, I'll just put it in the bathroom. Down here, I mean, I go in the bath. I don't really like this scent. I'm gonna plug in, to be honest. But, we're not gonna let it go to waste, are we? And, yeah. I don't think I've ever showed y'all like my bathroom. But it's cute, we got all the black. Um, you know, I'm waiting for my landlord to reach out to the builder so I can get another light bulb. But yeah, this is a little setup. And yeah, okay. And I need to like Louie outside, but that just reminds me because they're actually coming here in the morning to um fix some things, some more things. Y'all know I've been going through that. All right, just while well, my phone was not charging this whole entire time. Don't you hate when you do that? You take out something for something else and the plug is still here and you think automatically. All right, y'all, I need to go upstairs and film because I don't want the sun to go down. And yeah, that needs to be done. Let's go to work, y'all. Ah! So I'm in my beauty room, about to film. I have my outfit online that I'm about to film. Just got my boxes today. So I'm about to like flip this a little bit, give it a little jazz because I don't know what I wanna do to my hair for this video. And I don't know what I'm gonna do to my hair for tomorrow's dinner because my hair appointment for my braids isn't until Friday and I wanted it that way because I wanted my braids to be really fresh for Jamaica. My lashes, I think I get done on Thursday. Wanted to do those like two days before because I plan on getting in the water and I really want them to set in so they don't fall out. <clears throat> Cause you know, you're supposed to wait 24 hours before you even get them wet. Even though I'm like, am I really gonna get in the water? But I really wanna get in the water y'all, like dive and be a fish. So yeah, I'm about to go like kind of, I don't know what I'm about to do to my hair. This is why I don't do the natural like I used to. Because I don't know what I'm gonna do. When I get in here, the lighting just gets so warm because the lighting in here is so warm. So let's see here. What I wanna do, a little flippity flip. Pete is doing that. <laughs> what the fuck? 
Wait. <laughs> is this cute? Or does this look tacky? Okay, maybe if I just put this piece back, it won't be as bad because it was just a little too long. So. Like, I don't know if I should have little, let me bobby pin that little piece back because I like my little clip and I don't want to undo it and it not look the same. That looks crazy, but at the end of the day, who cares? Who really freaking cares? Like, what am I even doing? That's just too much. Too much. Too much. Too much. Yeah, that was too much to me. Add that to the piece. I'm just doing a little try on haul, so the face don't even really matter, boo. The hair, here we go, me and a man. Got hair in my mouth. Okay, let's see. Okay. Then you got this side, though, like this piece. The swoop, okay, sis. You see, you're messing up the swoop. Like, I'm like, should I just cut this piece or just kind of flip it back over there? Baby hairs. Gotta get them right. She's not trying to stay down for the team. Like, they just getting long. That's all. Oh, that was not supposed to be there, that's why. Gotta make sure the baby hairs is laid. Okay. Don't know what I'm doing, but it's gonna have to work for the video um like this piece stop trying to come out you don't belong all on this side of town but like you don't you know one thing i love when my baby hairs are out with braids like yes baby hairs Love me some braids with baby hairs, like, yes. This one's like kind of long. She's kind of harder to do my hair, my baby hairs, my hair is, like it's dirty, but it's not like super dirty, so don't really lay like I want because my hair really isn't too dirty. I should just, this piece is like, bothering me okay 
<laughs> let's go and get this try on all done before the sun goes out and I'm gonna be mad. Let's go. I'm like, I really wanna put it on. Because this is not putting on a makeup. Because I'm putting on makeup tomorrow. I love the Lawless lip glosses. This one is like a super pink. It's called Daisy Pink. I like using this one when I don't have on makeup because it gives my lips like, even though my lips are pretty good, cuts, you know, I have nice lips. Um, I like to use this one because it gives me like a, a little, you know, touch. Also, let me put y'all on our nail. Put me onto this. And this balm, when I tell you if you are dry and want to be moisturized, this is so good. Now, you may see it in Target and be like $10.99, but it's worth the $10.99. It has literally no smell. And it definitely soaks into your skin. Your skin is super soft. <clears throat> And I can always tell when lotions or body butters, oils, whatever are good. If I wake up in the morning and I'm still moisturized, not ashy, nowhere on my body, still moisturized, and this right here is it. Now, I will say this would be really good to mix with like an oil that has a smell to it, a scent to it, because I do like to smell like something, very much something, when I get out the shower and put on lotion, just it was more like nothing like you know your soap depending on what soap you use but the body washes i use i need to smell but i feel like you know rubbing this in kind of might take off the soap smell so i would use a nice scented oil you could even mix in another lightweight lotion that has a smell that you know certain lotions just are kind of just for the smell of it because it don't leave you moisturized but yeah Definitely recommend this use in Intensive Repair Restores Radiant Essential Oil Balm. Definitely taking this on vacay. Um, this is a favorite of mine. Get yours if you like to be super moisturized like me. Okay? Okay. Let's get back to work. I'm going to put this piece up. I'm going to give you a bottle of ink if I can't. Can't do it. And I don't want to take my clip off because you know when you take, you know, you do something and it just don't come out the same. About to be my story, so it's gonna have to be here. Let's go. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> I was trying to get into Tim. Hold on, let me put this one. Actually, I have three of them as y'all just saw I have three boxes and I'm going to be trying on my favorite set I'm pretty much gonna try all of them on but if there's different colors I'm not gonna try on the same set with the same color I'll just kind of show it next to I'll kind of just hold it up with the outfit I already have on so you guys can see the color for reference but let's get into this little try on haul I'm excited because my outfit online I just love them they're one of the sweetest nicest most thoughtful group of people company brand that i just love and genuinely love and i really like their clothes and everything is organic when it comes to the relationship we have and my relationship with the clothes as well 
Um, they are actually throwing me a dinner tomorrow. I'm pretty sure I told y'all in this vlog. They are throwing me a dinner tomorrow. They are coming all the way from Miami. I mean, it's not but they are flying from Miami to Atlanta. Like, what? <laughs> they love me that much. And they are throwing me a dinner to celebrate my second time working with them for the body collection. And I'm so excited because I got to invite all my closest friends. Some people couldn't make it because of personal reasons, but I'm excited for everyone that is going to be able to make it. And I'm just so excited because no one's ever really threw anything for me. You know what I mean? Like, no one's really thrown me a birthday or just a random something. No one's ever really thrown me. And it's not like a surprise, but it is kind of a surprise because I don't know what it's going to look like there. Um, also, it's at the garden room. And I've always wanted to go to the garden room. Never been. Normally they've been booked up and I kind of just haven't tried in a while. Um, so I'm so excited for tomorrow and I'm just excited to be able to have everyone in my outfit online. And you guys will see in this vlog how the dinner went pretty much like after this part. Um, take all around with me tomorrow. That leads up to the dinner. But yeah, I'm just so excited. And I'm so thankful for that, for my outfit online and the whole team and thankful that, you know, they want to work with me, continue working with me, brought me out to Miami. Um, we did our photo shoot and it's just always good vibes and I hope to continue working with them because at this point, we're all a big happy family and I just love them. So anyways, before I talk y'all's head off and the sun goes down because I wanted to use natural lighting, let's get into this try on haul, okay? And everything for Miles My Line for this body um, part two featuring me will be down in the description below with the sizes, the colors, and you don't want to miss out. You don't want to miss out like last time if you did because some of you guys did because they sold out super, super quick. Um, and yeah, also I'm going to tell you like size referencing, if it's a true to size, if you should go up a size, down a size. So let's get started. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you the box. Love the box. I already opened it because I wanted to sneak peek and see, you know. I already kind of knew it was in here, but this is how they are individually wrapped. And this is how all of my packages normally come. Um, with love from Miami to you. Okay, cute. So let's get started. All right, so this set I wanted to show first. I'm probably going to have to put a blur because it is see-through. But this set sold out in the last collection. And... I'm just like, this is one of my favorites because it's a run around type of outfit. Super comfortable. This is in a size small. And if you want it to be a little looser, I would go up a size. But I like the small because it sucks my waist in. You um, can wear the shirt alone as a basic nice t-shirt or you can tuck it in like I did. Me, I kind of like the look of it tucked in, but you can do either or. And I believe this comes in... This one comes in the white and I believe two other colors. Let me double check. So it comes in the white, which I really love white. Like I'm just, I just love white. It's just perfect. Love a good white set. But it also comes in this mocha color, which is brown, which I really, really like. Love, love, love this brown, especially on tan skin in the summertime, girl. And then you also have it in this color as well. Um, what color is this? Not gonna lie, guys, I forgot which color this is, but I will leave it on the screen for you guys right here. But it also comes in this very nude color, which I absolutely love as well. Like, all three of these <laughs> are gonna be worn all the time, okay? And they're just great to wear around the house, to go out and run errands. If you are going to meet up with some friends, maybe at the park, taking a walk, or you just want to be super chill, like I'm throwing these on with some golden gooses, some Nikes, slides, whatever you want to do. Me, personally, I would probably put it on with some sneakers. Um, but love these. I love the material of the shorts. Now, the shorts, the shorts, I will say, are not see-through for white. And I really like that because ain't nothing like to put on a, you know, bra, but... You don't want to see the panty lines like you really don't like you can get away a little bit with the bra depending on what type of bra you have on like to see the lining and stuff but panties it's just not ladylike it's not classy it's not cute and it's not see-through it's double lined and when you get them you will see that it is double lined and you will have the thick waistband and like i said double lined 
like just really good material so wanted to show you guys this first because this set is what sold out the first time so you have three colors this launch um last launch i think it was just white and black and then they had like a more of a pinkyish nude so this set we have this time around we have white mocha and then this nude color and these are a must have literally a must -have. all right so i wanted to show you this color on so this is a one piece biker short low back jumpsuit i was like they should make a short one called something else like a short suit <laughs> I don't know. but anyway so this is in a size small this is very breathable very stretchy um if you're a medium you will be able to fit this as well and this material is different from this material is more of how the shirt is more on the thinner side not double lined it's very comfortable which we always want this is really cute i love how it's not showing too much cleavage because i feel like Outfits, when you kind of want to be more chill and comfortable, you don't want to, you know, show too much. Me, personally, I don't really like showing cleavage on normal days when I'm running out to public stores, public places. I will show more cleavage, like, if I'm going out on a date, things like that, going out with my girls or on a date or whatever. Um, because that's just me. I can be very conservative sometimes, um, which is totally fine. And I really like this. Like, my mom would love tank tops like this because she is very conservative when it comes to her cleavage and she would love this high scoop so i really like this um love the color of this like i said i'll put the color of this one right here um super cute you can wear this with heels or you can wear it with sneakers and it comes to about right here mid thigh and i just love the back because you can make this really cute and classy dressed up um and you know the back kind of gives it more of a sexy look or you can do it with sneakers so there is a brown color also and then you also have the mocha color in this set as well exact same style low back this is what you guys have this is the bodysuit jumpsuit you guys saw in the pictures that were posted on my outfit online in the video that I had posted on my Instagram, the real. This color is so bomb. Next. All right, so next, I will, by the way, these all have names, so I will put the names right here for you guys on which set this is. I just don't know all of them, I, the names of them right here so you can screenshot maybe the ones you want. But y'all, look at this mocha color for one. Look at the slit. Look at how it holds the body. Look at the back, the low back. You guys can't see my feet, but it is a long dress. Let me see if I can. A long dress. It comes all the way down past my ankle. I am 5'7 for reference. And this is just so cute. I love, love, love this color. This is great for vacation. Great for vacation. Such a vacation vibe. You can wear it. This is definitely a dress you can wear to dinner and make it super classy and dress it up. Or you could dress it down with slides or sneakers. Y'all know I'm going to throw that in there. Again, high scoop neck. I will say the straps on this one's a little tight. Um, you know, sometimes the way certain things can be made, some of them may not. Some of them may, you know, slightly be a little off. Just, you know how some items you may order, it just may be a bad batch. Not saying this is a bad batch, but this one is a little tight on the shoulder parts. And from when I was trying these on at the photo shoot, it shouldn't be like that. But it is definitely holding together. And I really, really love this color. But we also have the color, um, we also have this, and we also have it in the other nude color. Let me show you. And here it is in the nude color. Exact same dress, but in this blushy nude. It's not really blushy because the last collection was more of a blushy nude. I don't even know how I would describe this, but the name and the color will be right here for you. So cute. And then we have this two piece. This is one of my favorites. Y'all know I know. Y'all know if y'all know, y'all know I love a two piece legging set. Okay, so. First of all, love this color. 
two-piece leggings, 5'7 for reference. It goes all the way down to my ankles, as you can see. Louis trying to play, because you know he always wants to be involved. Um, so again, I have the shirt tucked in with the pants because I just feel like I would wear it this way because it gives it kind of like a nice little jumpsuit one-piece kind of look, but still two-piece. Has a thick band. Um, I will say that when I tried these on in... When I tried these on for the photo shoot, I tried them on in the mocha brown color and they were a bit tighter. So I don't know about y'all, but certain colors in clothing in all brands, not even just my outfit online, I feel like certain colors sometimes run a little different. Um, this color is definitely looser than I expected. It's a small and the pants are what was tight on me at the photo shoot and this is just me being transparent. Um, reference to, for reference size, so I will say the mocha size, um, actually in all of the mocha colors seem to be a little tighter because even the jumpsuit, um, the two, the, the jumpsuit short set, the jumpsuit and the short set, biker short set and the dress were all a little bit tighter than this small. So I would say the mocha, if you want it to be not super tight, I would go up a size. Um, but here it is untucked and you could wear this shirt alone with jeans, whatever else you want to wear it with. You could wear the leggings with anything else you want to wear it with. Love, love, love this color. Like I'm just obsessed with this body collection. Okay. All right. So this one comes in the mocha color. That's it. It's just these two colors. It doesn't come in white. It just comes in the mocha color and this one. So I have one more outfit to show you, okay? One second. So I lied, I actually have this and one more to show you. So we have this dress right here. As you guys can see, it goes all the way down to my feet. It flares at the bottom. Then you have the low back, which you also have the back that's cute like this with the, it's a nice little cut in the back. I like this one because the bottom Watch out, Louie. The bottom is different and flares at the bottom, which I really, really like. And I'm actually going to be wearing this one in white to my dinner tomorrow. And I just think this is just super classy and very put together. It shapes the body. I love this color. So cute. Or you could wear it like this. <laughs> but I feel like it just gives it more of a... Um, and gives you that nice hourglass with heels. So let me show you the last one. It's in the mocha color as well. It's a full body long jumpsuit. All right, so this is the last one. And this is a full body jumpsuit with a low back, size small. Goes all the way down past my ankles. Shapes the body. And they all have this scoop neck tank look to it all of the all of these sets outfits i've showed you except for like the two-piece sets the short sets and the pants set have a different type of top but this is so cute and i'm just loving this mocha color and the low back my outfit online my outfit online a lot of their things have the low back and i love that it's kind of like their signature look and yeah. super cute so out of breath. Mm. Nothing like some nice cold water. Okay, so that is it for this try on haul. I hope you guys like the pieces that I showed you. Um, some this one also I believe comes in that nude color as well. Um, there's just so many different ones, and not all of them come in all the same. Not all of them have every color in that collection. So, like I said, I will leave the name and the color next to each outfit that i tried on and all the links will be down in the description below so you can check to see if they came in the color that you want there's only three colors um so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this try on haul and look forward to tomorrow seeing some people at my dinner and meeting my outfit online because they will be on camera because it will be a part of this vlog and i'm trying to think did i miss anything else i don't think so I literally tried on everything except for the you know every color but y'all get the gist 
my hair lasted a little bit, you know? So yeah, that was this try on haul. It's giving body yaddy yaddy yaddy, you know, because it is the body collection. <laughs> um, so yeah, now I am about to finish out the rest of my work day and figure out what I'm going to eat. Thank you so much, my outfit online, for all of these pieces and using me to work with you guys again with this collection love you guys so so much and i will see you guys tomorrow well not y'all because y'all might see me tonight but my outfit online they are seeing me tomorrow and y'all will see me tomorrow too but that's it y'all size small colors and names screenshot go back if you need to and links in the description below okay first of all how cute is this invitation everyone got an invitation Pretty similar to this for the dinner on Wednesday. Yes, that is me in the back. Okay, how cute is me? <laughs> all right, so I'm about. All right, so I'm about to make these cucumbers. Um. Oh boy, these dishes. Get me a bowl. Okay. So I got my cucumbers, my bowl. I got the Korean. This is supposed to be the Korean chili powder, I guess. Um, seasoned rice vinegar called for. Spicy chili crisp, sesame oil. Um, I called for salt to rinse off the cucumbers. Um, I think it called for some other things. I need to look at the video. Where's my phone? This is the video that I saw they made me want to try them. I wish I had the other cucumbers because they look so cool. So. Pillars and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Yeah. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. These are baby mini cucumbers. <laughs> like, this is great for dipping. <laughs> the ones that I have. Damn. Salt to draw out moisture. Okay, to draw out now moisture. Off all the salt. Chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this okay. really easy Asian this. cucumber salad ever. So, get my cucumbers. Actually, I need to cut them up. And I am not about to make a whole dish using cutting boards. So we're gonna cut them. <laughs> really don't have to do them this way, but thought it'd be cute. Let's see if mine turn out the way it did. You know, I'm gonna just go ahead and cut mine like so because that did not work <laughs> at all. I'm about to use all these cucumbers because there's so many and they smell so good though. It's me being that lazy to not. Get a cutting board, but judge me. Judge me!
not trying to cut up my counter, y'all. That's why I'm going to do it like this. Kind of rip them apart. Oop. There you go. Time drop for Lily. some salt. Did I break it? Opened it the wrong way, y'all. I had a feeling. Okay. I'm gonna go rinse them off. the video so that's what okay. we're making mini cube chopsticks damn salt to draw out moisture now rinse off all the salt chili crisp Rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars, and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. Damn. Salt to draw out moisture. Now rinse off all the salt, chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars, and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. Draw out moisture. Now rinse off all the salt, chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars, and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. Draw 
moisture. Now rinse off all the salt. Chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. Wow, I don't have sugar! I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. moisture. Now rinse off all the salt, chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. Moisture. Now rinse off all the salt, chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame oil. I've been seeing this really easy Asian cucumber salad everywhere. It reminds me of a bunch of caterpillars and it's awesome. So that's what we're making. Mini cucumber. Chopsticks. Moisture. Now rinse off all the salt, chili crisp, rice vinegar, sugar, Korean chili flakes, garlic, and sesame. All right, y'all. Let's give it a taste. This is what she is looking like. Okay. Let's see. That's not bad. I'm gonna put a little more of the kick to it. It's not really spicy. But it is good. Mm. Okay. Mm. This would be good with some rice. Like, I already like the cucumber salad, like American style or whatever, with all the vinegar, salt, and pepper. That's a good little healthy snack. Super easy. This is so good. Mmm. Mmm. Good morning. I have my apple cider vinegar lemon tea with cayenne pepper um, for my trip. Gotta have a flat stomach. Told y'all I'm be drinking my tea. I had a glass or a mug last night, and now it's morning time, and I'm having mine. Um, I used to drink this very often when I was on my weight loss journey when I was in the gym at one point a year ago. Um, and actually it doesn't taste too bad to me. Like I can drink this without it being like I feel like I'm forcing myself. But it's 9 30 and the um builder um is here. Well the people the builder was here. He's doing some other things out in the neighborhood, but the people are here fixing, you know, little nicks and nacks. Um things that need to be fixed in the house. They're fixing the big ass hole that's in my roof in my garage when they had to come and fix the ac and i'm just kind of upstairs out of the way in the quiet um i really need to like for times like this i just like i wish i had my office done so i can go chill in there i mean i could go sit in my beauty room but my beauty room really is in like an office desk area um so i'm just chilling on there right now um, don't really like to chill in the bed when 
I have my clothes on and stuff. But I'm clean. These are fresh, clean clothes. So it's okay. Um, so, yeah. I'm about to just work on some editing and try to get some of this done because I have my nail appointment at 11. And um, I need to finish up some editing from yesterday I didn't finish because I'm not trying to have to wake up tomorrow morning and edit a whole bunch of content because it has to go live at a certain time and depending on how tonight goes with drinking i don't want to have to feel obligated to have to wake up at the crack of dawn to finish work so i'm about to get some of that done while i can today after i get my nails done i have to run to the mall or spanx because the dress for tonight is in my outfit online dress and they want they it's like the theme of tonight is kind of like everyone is wearing my outfit online, whichever outfit they picked, but I'm the only one wearing white and the white is very, it is see-through, not even going to lie. So I need to find some type of spanks just for the booty part, leg part, because it's low back, so I can't do anything on the back. Um, so I'm going to be in the mall looking for those or I'm going to go to Spanx and the Buckhead shops. Um, that's the big park. And then, um, that's pretty much it. Then I'm coming back home and I'm filming my makeup tutorial for getting ready for tonight. So, that's today's plans. Let me go see why Louis is parking. So, <clears throat> I'm running late to my nail appointment, 10 minutes late, because I went to Starbucks. Mind you, I was doing so good on schedule, y'all. Left my house at like 10.40. Starbucks is literally, when I say across the street, like, takes me one minute to get there. It takes me one minute to get there on, in the car. On feet, it's five. So, I get there, line hella long. So I'm like, all right, let me just park, go inside. Might be quicker. Girl, get in there, order. There was no line. I went, and there was only one person ahead of me. Went and ordered. Took so long, I was able to eat my little sandwich in there. And um, I was able to eat my little sandwich in there. But my drink was taking forever, y'all. Like, I kid you not, I was in there 15 minutes. 15 minutes, so. Speeding a little bit, but I told Sky I'm running late, so you know, we're all good, but yeah, like damn, I was doing so good on time, being very productive. Got my brown sugar shake and espresso. Um, I did make one at home today, but um, yeah, I got my coffee for the day, so let's get today started. I'd even show y'all like my outfit, but I'm loving this top. It's like a very nude top. So soft, so stretchy. This brand story, I'll leave the link for you guys. Um, has sent me some athletic wear and I when I tell you the material is so stretchy and soft. So stretchy and soft. Um I was actually just having a conversation with, I, well, I've actually worn some of their stuff in a vlog. My last vlog, it was like this black two-piece. It was like a sleeve type shirt, um, crop top type of shirt. But um, you know how some athletic wear, like the leggings aren't very like sculpting, like it doesn't really compress anything together. These leggings aren't like compressing like, you know, things together like on the waistband. Um, they're more so like, you know, they kind of remind me of Lululemon, the material. Um, very soft, very stretchy, um, just kind of lays on your body. Um, but one of my favorite favorites are, um, oh, what is it called? Gymshark. I love Gymshark because it's so tight on like the waist part and just everywhere, like everywhere the legs the booty it just sits everything up really really nice not saying these don't but there's just a different type it's a different type of material and different materials do different things for your body and really like you know so it's a 
somebody's gas, this truck's gas is like coming through and it's blowing me because it's so strong. But yeah, so this is from Story. I'm absolutely loving it. I have on a sports bra under it from them as well. And then it's just regular black leggings that I have on, high waist black leggings. And they come all the way past my ankles. I also have a pair of biker shorts from them. Um, yeah, so you'll have to check them out. I'll leave the link down below for you guys. But um, I'll catch you guys at the nail shop. Okay, y'all, don't hate me. I'm back home. I didn't take y'all home with me to get my nails done because it's pointless. Like, well, I'm gonna just show y'all the process. Y'all know how to get y'all nails done. These are my nails. Um, I got like little yellow tips with chrome gold. I just be trying shit and I be trying to step out the box by still making it to where it's not too much. And I don't know if I'm feeling the gold. Anyways, my toes look cute. Um, these are definitely coming off after vacay, like not feeling the gold, but the gold is giving more like bronzy vacay. Um, I have made some kava right here because I was gonna make my own salad, but it's already 4.30. And I have to start filming no later than six. And um, yeah, I was like, I'm not about to sit here and take up some time by making me some food, which was gonna take too long, but whatever. I stopped at Trader Joe's because I needed to get some mini cucumbers because I wanna make some more of the, um, the salad I had made. So I picked up a few of the things. I was literally in Trader Joe's for five minutes in and out. Um, I got some stuff for Zara, but nothing's for my trip. I spent $348 on an outfit and a dress. Crazy. And then I got some stuff from Neiman. Some, um, I'm actually, this, it's this Nest brand hand soap, and I got one of the, like, scented diffuser things for my bathroom. So I'll show y'all once I open that. But I'm about to eat and chill for, like, 30 minutes do some stuff on my computer, and then start getting ready. Yeah. All right, so I just woke up from a nap. I'm so tired, y'all. I needed a nap before I headed out to dinner tonight. But let me go ahead and show y'all the soap. So it's by the brand Ness. And this is just what it looks like. But it smells so freaking good. So good. Like, so good. So I'm about to put this in my kitchen because it just smells that good. Have one there in the kitchen. You know? Let me see what I got in the mail. I'm gonna take the rest upstairs. But let me see what I got here. I think it's a bathing suit from Elise. They have reached out to me to send me a bikini for before my trip. Oh, they sent me two. This is the one I saw that I really liked. This is so cute. It's a little bikini. I love the tie dye. Size small. This is so cute. I can't wait to wear this on my trip. Elise, I believe. I believe. <clears throat> and then we also have the zebra one. Ooh, this is so cute. Fun fact about me, I still love zebra print growing up. Loved it. This is so cute. I can't wait to try these on and see how they look. This is so cute. This one is a little different. This one ties like this. That's cute. I like that. I like that a lot. All right, I'm gonna have something in this box. Let's see what's in the mystery box. Some type of 
or something. Yeah. Never can go wrong with makeup bags. Ooh, from Lawless. I was just telling you about them. And their lip glosses. <clears throat> Ooh, concealer brush. I'm gonna use this tonight. I love a good concealer brush. Ooh. Ooh, I can't wait to use this. Period. Let's see what else we got in this little bag. Oh, concealer. I love concealer. Concealers. And these look good. These look like, these look really good. These look like my shade. And one of them looks perfect for like a vacay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna have to try these out tonight and see how they blend. Love that. And a makeup bag. Bro, go eat. I think you got some. I love this makeup bag. I be loving when brands do this because pretty much all my makeup bags um come from brands love that let's see conceal the deal lightweight long wear area concealer with caffeine so it's supposed to be lightweight is a full cover though so they have 20 shades retailing for 26 dollars they launch on the 29th in stores and support on april 22nd Hmm. Okay, let's give it a try. All right, y'all, I'm about to go shower. Catch on a little. I am running so late, it's not even funny. Like, it's not even funny how late I'm running, y'all. Like, oh my goodness. My damn spandex that I bought. Oh boy. They ripped. But I still have them on. Can't really tell. But, y'all, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Here it is, the outfit, okay? You can kind of see where it ripped, where it's like kind of tight on this side, but it's not see-through and that's really what I was worried about, so. We're good, let's go. Don't worry and everything, yes, we're ready to go. <laughs> so happy for you, thank, thank you so you much. So much. Okay. Oh! Tequila and one vodka for a lady, please. Multiple. Two vodka. Two vodka. Two vodka. She said it. You want to do those all chilled with lives? Who's doing the vodka? We're doing. Diora. I love that. Chewbacca, right? Sorry, I'm pointing at Oh, so cute. So, we're going to pass this beautiful wine glass. This wine glass has some questions. In the questions, you guys are gonna each grab one, right? And you guys are just gonna ask a question to the table. We're all gonna popcorn answer, jump in. The questions are good. Um, Rule. And, oh, okay. If you <laughs> grab it, you have to answer the question if before not, people start. Yeah. So you have to answer the question you grab, and then people can popcorn. And if it's too personal, make up something. <laughs> time out, we need story time. If it's too personal, you're gonna say the truth. And then you're gonna let me know if I She's like, no, <laughs> speak your <laughs> truth. Okay. Speak your truth. <laughs> All right, so I'm gonna shake. Wait, who wants to start? Uh, okay, we'll start you. We'll just go around. What you said, too. So you pull it out and you need to answer it. Absolutely, yeah. yes. Okay. And then, and then, and then, and then, and then what? Yeah, everyone else could jump in. If they, they want to answer it, you have to read the question out loud. Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. If no, you gotta read. Okay. You want me to read it? That's how we play No, I got it. What is one thing you believe everyone should experience and why? Um, that's a good one. Hmm. I'd say traveling out of the country. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Because some people don't do that. Some people no, don't no, do that. 
I want to hear more. Traveling, that's all. Yeah, traveling. And what's your favorite place For me, it's probably the Dominican Republic. Yeah, yeah. Yeah? Sorry. That's fun. I've been twice. It's fun. I love the DR. I'm not. All right. Who's next? Who wants to go next? Okay. Support. Okay, here we go. Here we go, Canada. No. If you could only eat one food slash meal for the rest of the year, what would it be? Can I say it one more time? Yeah, well, if you could only eat one food slash meal for the rest of the year, what would it be? Oh, like oh you're ignoring the little <laughs> right, right. mm. I added the little yeah. yeah. oh, yeah. Mine is definitely. No, <laughs> let me go. Mac and cheese or pasta? pasta. Yeah. Oh no! Don't think about your favorite. Think about survival. Oh wow. That was good. Uh, right. right. <laughs> Spinach. A Caesar salad. A sandwich. Caesar salad. I think I would do a grilled chicken Caesar salad. I would do chicken. Just but you would just eat eggs only? She's just so eggs? Oh what? You don't have any food, you have to have water. Meal, meal. Oh, meal. Oh, my bad. Oh, so a meal? Oh, shit. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, he said it's a night food. Pasta. You guys said it. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. Oh, here comes the shot. Yeah. You can switch it up. Shot o'clock. Uh, uh, next. I'm uh, oh, God. <laughs> She's like, he's like, oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Okay. What are words you feel everyone should live by? Take accountability for your actions. I knew she was gonna say something like that. Tell us the story. Yeah. Tell us the story. Yeah. About what? <laughs> that came from the heart. Yeah. Like, no, because I really, I don't person. like people who really don't aren't accountable. So I'll just keep it that short. But I really think that to be the highest version of yourself as an individual, you have to constantly strive to be accountable with yourself. You know what I mean? So it's and like, false accountability yeah. is real and is Yeah, yeah. So for sure. It's counterproductive. So it's like, okay. you know, you gotta tap into being accountable. <laughs> <laughs> I agree. I agree. I agree on that too. Yeah, what's Thank your, you. what's your, um, what are the words you feel like you should look like? Oh, well, I actually made a post, or I posted, I had reposted them the other day, and it said, that this is my world. No, it said when I realized that this is my world and y'all are just living in it, I stopped getting mad about stuff. Because I feel like, because I feel like this is your world, your world, your world, so nobody really should be mad about nothing. So I'm not gonna yeah. be mad about nothing. Yeah. Like, y'all living in my world. In this way. seat, like, in this seat right here, y'all in my world. world. Like, yep. And in your For sense, sure. this is your world and everybody else is living in your world. Like, Everyone has their own I world. I feel like I live my no matter own. what word you are living by, just keep your word. Yeah. Yeah. Period. That's, that's mine for sure. Stand true to your word. So we got, we got some shots. Shout out.